What is up YouTube? We have a bag of shit to go post. It's the weekend, Saturday morning. We're gonna go thrifting. I have too much shit, but we're gonna go thrifting. I went through this week and took photos of all my death pile shit. Um, I haven't listed it yet, but uh, this week will be the uh, week that I list it. But at least all the photos are taken and it's ready to roll, so um, death pile is all on the shelves. Death pile is no more. So now it's time to make a new death pile. So in saying that, we're making a new death pile. Come thrift with me. Let's do it. Come ride with me, let's thrift, let's thrift all day. When you go down to up shop town, don't have a dog shit day. So ride with me, let's thrift, let's thrift away. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit three thrift shops, then I'm gonna post this shit, and then there's one other thrift shop. We'll do it that way. What I'm gonna do is every Tuesday hit up a ride along, and every Thursday will be the show and tell. And then if I've got any other bits and pieces videos, I'll fucking smash them up at every uh, and chuck them on whenever. But. Uh, I think what we'll do is uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays, I think, will be our uh, days to um, join and subscribe, okay? So Tuesdays and Thursdays will be my main shows. Let's go thrifting now. Let's go to this first one. This one's a bit average at most, usually, but we'll go in and we'll have a little look. The second one, I know, is always my favorite. Always my favorite. Uh, all right, we've got this nice, big, juicy salvos. These guys are fucking running in there, fucking want to get some bargains, get some summer clothes. Those bins look empty at the front. This guy, he was awesome. He told me there was 50% off green tags, 50% off, but uh, I'm just not good at buying clothes. Found this, I uh, can't remember the brand, what it is now that I uh, sell, um, Tommy something, anyway, it was open, the box was ripped and sticky taped. I nearly thought I was going to uh, get some more baby items, which would have been sweet. Always, never, never, never pass the uh, children's books. I do go back and look through those children's books, don't find anything. But don't go past them, because uh, children's books, you'll find some good vintage stuff. found a cool He-Man uh, 50 cent book uh, from the 80s, and I got 50 bucks for that once. So never look past the children's book. I didn't know what soccer club this uh, little plush toy was from, so I didn't bother. I couldn't figure it out. Didn't bother. Then we uh, go past all the used mattresses, the ones with the shit stains and all the uh, dirty, dirty uh, marks on them. And um, we have a little look at the uh, electronics. Electronics weren't that good today at this store. Uh, there was that red rolling machine. Um, no, it's not a rolling machine for joints. Uh, we had a little look through uh, the records. Once again, it's just all the old jazz and uh, marching bands and Kamal. I don't even know what uh, songs Kamal sings, but god damn, he's got a lot of fucking... Uh, he's got a lot of fucking records. I uh, found these softbox toys. Now, these softbox toys were sealed and $2 each. Now, I'll show you these in my uh, show and tell. But, man, before I even looked them up, I chucked them in my basket. I was taking those. No one else has taken that shit off me. I found it first, fuckers. I fucking found it first. So you make your own teddy. Make your own teddy. and It's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Um, kids can make their own uh, teddy and all that. Something family can do together, I guess. I don't know. But uh, if it sells and puts money in my pocket, I don't give a shit. The <laughs> Shredder. Not the shredder I want. I want the Ninja Turtle shredder, not that crappy shredder. Nah, I had a look through all this stuff. Pretty much all crap. Look through all the cups. There was a cool Star Wars one there, but uh, it was one of the new new ones. Audrey Hepburn uh, mug as well. Nothing that was old and vintage that was uh, going to get me some good dollars. But uh, that's alright. We had a little look anyway, because you always got to have a little look around. 
you never know what you're going to find when you're at these uh, op shops. And the op shops are quite busy um, this weekend, it was anyway. A lot of people thrifting, a lot of people thrifting, uh, trying to make some extra money because um, Christmas time's coming up. There's a microscope that was not worth anything and it was pretty damaged. Look at all those high vests, high, 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 big orange fucking shirts. All right, the shoes. I wanted to have a look at the shoes. I'm going to try and start selling shoes. Had a little look. There was some footy boots and uh, all that, but I did not know what the fuck I was looking at. No idea at all. Suitcases, no thank you. Uh, it was those, uh, FIFA, not FIFA, Fila. I can't remember what the brand was now, but uh, no good, no good. DVDs were overpriced, unfortunately. Hate going to the op shops when they want to charge three bucks a DVD. Three dollars. Are you fucking crazy? You are fucking nuts. But that's what they want to uh, charge. They're just going to sit on the shelves and no one is going to buy them. But you still got to have a little look through anyway. And once, of, and once again, of course, we look at the games and you've got your... Typical FIFA, old FIFA games. No one wants their FIFA games. Um, when I eventually do with the camera, I do go up there and uh, have a little look. Skis at the games. There we go. And uh, yeah, it's just your FIFA CDs. There was no good CDs, but geez, FIFA games. I tell you, and Dora the Explorer, not worth a penny. Not worth anything. Unfortunately. And CDs, I know a lot of people go through and scan every single CD, but fuck, how much time do you have? Like, really? Good setup of books. Did look through the books, there was just nothing. Oh, there was Twilight? Hey, does anyone want Twilight? That op shop is always and usually pretty shit. Um, but I did get those bear maker teddy sew up a teddy things they were two dollars each i'll uh, show you those all on the uh, show and tell i put the um shoes back the boots back couldn't find them couldn't find listings couldn't find a good price there was a fair there's a fair few people in there i'm skipping that vinnie's because that vinnie sucks dick it actually fucking gets a big dick in its mouth and fucking it sucks it that's how shit that store is hate that fucking vinnie's so i'm driving straight past it Every time I've gone there, it's just been bad luck and overpriced shit. So we're going past that one. We're going to my fave. We're going to my fave. I've got a good feeling about this one. But fuck, op shops are packed at the moment. It's just fucking people were just coming in and coming in. Pretty crazy. Everyone wanted to make some money. Ah, traffic jam. All right. Cool, cool. This good Sammy's is the best good Sammy's. I've seen two people fucking speed in front of me. I think they recognise the fucking Aussie thrifter. So, I think they've gone straight to the games. So I'm probably going to be out of luck, but it is what it is. So I went straight to the games, and these motherfuckers had already gone to the games and cleaned it out. Oh well, shit happens. It's the luck of the draw. But had a little look for the DVDs, they were a dollar each, not too bad for a dollar each. Uh, couldn't really see anything uh, to start with. Did go straight to the games though, of course. And the only games that were left were absolute crap. You know, once again, your FIFAs and all that crap. No one wants that shit. But that's okay. I had a look for the DVDs. Um, there was a few Blu-rays and all that as well. Empty basket at the moment. But don't you worry, I fucking find some stuff. Uh, the Blu-rays were no good. The DVDs were kind of no good. But I see over in the corner there. Ooh, I see a bunch of Doctor Who DVDs. So, I, I, I didn't jump at it straight away, to be honest. Um, the, this guy pissed me off, though, because he had all the fucking games. Look at him, and he knows. Yeah, yeah, you got the games. Go on, fucking run, mate. Fucking run, mate. He took all the fucking games. So he's got all the good games. Took my focus off the Doctor Who because he fucking had my games. But that's alright. So we had a little look around here. 
and um, I saw this cool little um, roulette. Was it a roulette? Yeah, roulette. Uh, so we'll spin that and see what number you get. I just wanted to spin it. I just wanted to have a little look, but it was all plastic. It was no good for $5. I was thinking about buying it, setting up a home casino, trying to make some extra money. Uh, no good. Maybe I should have brought it for fun, and we could have uh, played with it, but uh, that's all right. I had a look at the kids' books. Like I said, never bypass the kids' books. There is a... Star Wars, uh, a few Star Wars books there. I grabbed a few for myself, and there were some other kids' ones, which I will show you in show and tell. <laughs> all right. And oh, look at all the records. All the Kamal records on the uh, wall there. No, they couldn't sell the Kamal records, so they fucking pinned them all up there. But we had a little look through, and uh, there was some uh, more shit and shit. And, uh, oh, just some more shit. Yep, so that was all crap. That was a, that was a dog shit pile of records. Uh, no Kamal ones in there, because they've uh, pinned them all up on the wall. And we have a look at the um, mugs. Unfortunately, no good mugs at this place. I found this Stein. I typed it in, but um, it was not worth anything. The toys. always like looking for the toys. Make sure you look for the toys. But there was so many... It was packed there. It was so many fucking kids running amok and throwing the toys on the floor and breaking shit and oh man it was just it was actually it was kind of pissing me off it was pissing me off a little bit but it was all baby toys in there and i don't buy baby toys so i go but you don't want to resell used baby toys kids can't use that shit but uh i'll go back to the doctor who dvds there was 14 all together so i get them i grab them for myself because I had a quick little look to see if it is even worth it. And I've sold Doctor Who before. Doctor Who uh, DVDs. And they sell alright. And they sell pretty good. So I grab them. And I get the fuck out of there. That was pretty good in the end. Uh, I did put the camera down to um, to look deeply in all the books, in all the kids' books, because kids' books you do get some good money for. Um, I got a whole heap of uh, kids' books for 50 cents each, and they were in rough shape. But um, I did pick up a whole heap of Goosebumps books. Now, if you can get Goosebumps books and lot them, um, so really with the Goosebumps books I probably would have paid about six bucks for a big uh, uh, for that's about 12 of them but I'm not going to put them up for sale straight away I'll double check the prices but uh, I want to um, see if I can keep uh, getting some of those cheap so I can keep lotting them up I found some Star Wars books for myself so they're not going to come out of the cost but all those uh, Doctor Who DVDs are going to be fucking good because Doctor Who DVDs sell and especially when you can pick them up for a dollar each and you can get 10 bucks for them you're fucking laughing you're laughing so um so spewing i turned off the camera at the wrong fucking minute this fucking lady this psycho lady fucking comes to the counter and um just walk across the road casually bud just walk across the road casually you fucking tool so this fucking psycho angry lady fucking waiting behind me while i'm paying and she goes, oh, the other lady said, oh, how you doing? She goes, I'm good. But this other lady, bang, bang, she starts smashing the fucking table, bang, bang. This lady fucking ignored me. This lady ignored me. I've got my receipt now, blah, blah, blah. I was, damn. Just when you don't have the fucking camera on, you miss the good shit. So I don't know what this fucking lady was going on about. She looked like she was fucking, fucking nuts. She wanted maybe a two dollar fucking return or something from the op shop. It's an op shop. Get over it. All right. Anyway, I am doing thirty over the limit, so let's slow down. Um, I am going to the post office now because I actually only have half an hour to post this shit, and then we will uh, go hit up a couple more op shops on the way home. Um, so far, I've done all right. I think I've spent. 50 bucks and I only wanted to spend about 20 today but the puzzle that will sell the uh, DVDs that I got were definitely worth it Doctor Who was always worth it um, 
I think what I got today is pretty good. And then I got some cool Star Wars stuff for myself as well, some Star Wars books. I'm not selling them. I know they can sell, but I'm not selling them. So anyway, let's post this shit. Let's post this shit. The customers are waiting for my orders. The customers are waiting for my videos. They want their videos. They want their videos now. Posting is fucking done. Now, just around the corner, because this is not the post office I usually go to, there's a new independent op shop. I am going to fucking go destroy that place. I'm going to go pick this shit out of it and fucking upsell like a motherfucker. Good stuff. Just park in the middle there. Fucking cheers, guys. I've been getting a bit of fucking road rage lately. Fucking people piss me off. I fucking I, I hate them. All right. It's just here. It was literally across the road from the post office, but you got to do a fucking zigzag out of the car park to get to it. I'm excited what I'm going to get here. This could be good or shit. I like these independent fucking ones because they just shove junk everywhere. Fuck. They just shove junk everywhere and I love it. I love junk. Who doesn't fucking love junk? And I told everyone to stay home and go through your death pile and don't go thrifting today. So all the op shops are empty for me. <laughs> because I've done my death pile. Haven't listed it, but I've taken photos and cleaned up. Do your death piles. All right, let's have a look at this one. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know if I want to get out of my fucking car. This big fucking dog's got a window down that's fucking looking at me like it wants to kill me. I think he's all right. You all right? You gonna, you gonna kill me? Oh, Jesus. Fuck. If this video doesn't get posted, I'll die. Alright, so you, this is a St. Nicholas op shop, never heard of it, new one, kind of an independent one, not too bad at all. Uh, that dog I was scared was going to kill me, it, I don't know what it was, if it was a Rottweiler or a Pitbull or something, but it was scaring the shit out of me, and the window was down all the way. Anyway, close, 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 as soon as we walk in. Uh, woman's wet dream right there, if you uh, enjoy reselling clothes but oh look in the cabinet there look at that little playstation game right there oh yes we do pick that up at the end uh, you will see that in show and tell fucking goodbye that one uh the dvds not bad look at this record look at this record the black and white minstrel show what it's a bunch of gollywogs it's a bunch of gollywogs on a record oh and videos and i found a bunch of videos underneath it uh, I probably should have brought that record. It was two or three bucks, though. It would have been funny to listen to. It wouldn't have been worth anything. Um, so, yeah, this box of videos were dog shit. Absolute dog shit. Uh, nothing in there at all. Absolutely crap. But, <clears throat> oh, yeah, there was another box right next to it. Fuck off, gingerbread man. We don't want that shit. Ren and Stimpy, thank you very much. Chick ching, chick ching. I will take that. And another Ren and Stimpy. Oh, fuck yeah. We take that shit as well. Milton the Monster. Oof, wait till you see how much that was worth. Because I was almost going to put that back. But for 50 cents, we grabbed it. My pet monster. Hell yes. And where is Wally? We found him and we're fucking grabbing it. And that was about it in there. Rugrats don't do well. Hey Arnold and those Disney ones, not that good at all. So that was it for the uh, videos. And that was a pretty good find to find those videos. I was happy with that. Look how happy I am. Fuck yeah, I am happy. TNA Impact, not worth anything, unfortunately. It wasn't a bad game, that one, actually. But, um, yeah, the CDs were a bit uh, average at most. I actually uh, knocked shit down here as I, um, I was looking through because I found some more videos in a box set behind there. And this street, I can't remember what they wanted for it. I think it was 10 bucks. I'm not sure. It was a rip-off. And then, bang! Dropped a whole heap of shit on the floor. Didn't care. I did not fucking care. No, I picked it up. I didn't care. But I picked it up. The games, uh, all the puzzles were open. You never know if there's going to be pieces missing or not. Look at that Kodak. It was a Kodak uh, puzzle. 
Um, Atmosphere is actually a pretty damn good game. That's the one with the DVD. That's, uh, if you remember, Nightmare. Atmosphere is uh, the DVD version of it. They wanted 20 bucks firm. It said 20 bucks firm on there. So, unfortunately, not worth... Uh, not worth. I have sold uh, Atmosphere before for thirty dollars, but it's been the uh, Egyptian mummy version. I wanted that uh, blockbuster book, but they wanted three bucks. So I chucked that back. So you got to end a good thrift. Well, it's been good to you. You got to have some Maccas because Maccas is the soul of thrifting. Put this grease through your veins, and you will become the greatest thrifter you have ever been. I love it when the grease just fucking oozes out of it. You know, you know in a couple of hours time, it's not going to be pretty. But, enjoy the moment. Enjoy the moment of the burger. Ronald McDonald, you're the greatest. I love you. I love you, Ronald. He's been feeding us all for years. Vote him number one. President. Prime Minister. Ronald. Oh, I feel sick. I fucking hate you, Ronald. Oh, all right. Oh, I actually do feel. Went down good first, not then. All right. We are done. Oh, Jesus. All right, we're done. Um, Holy shit. All right, that Maccas didn't sit well. Um, we're done. We're uh, done a fair few fucking thrift jobs that were pretty good. And um, <clears throat> I'll do the uh, show and tell on Thursday for you. Oh, no. Uh, uh. On the way home is that fucking uh, op shop from last week. It's literally like three minutes away from here and I was taking a fucking shortcut back way. Yeah! We're gonna fucking go there and see if they put any more baby stock out. Let's have a look, quick little look. We're just gonna go into that one, not the other ones. We've spent enough, we've got enough shit. We've got enough crap to list. Let's just go there and see if they put any more baby stuff out. Love it when people don't know how to drive. It looks like she's had her license for fucking 70 years. Still doesn't know what the fuck she's doing. This cunt here just fucking drives in the middle of the fucking road. Good stuff, dickhead. Oh, I don't know how to smoke. I need a smoke. All right, guys, that's it. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, that last one, I did find uh, one more packet of all those. Um... Oh, that car's going fucking fast. Oh, go, go. All right, so I did get um, some more of those baby things, but one more box for $3. Uh, eight bucks each, four of them in there. Uh, you do the math. Um, I can't even remember what else. I grabbed a jigsaw puzzle. I grabbed a jigsaw puzzle in there, some Japanese one. What's with today? It started off cold, now it's fucking hot. And my eyes are fucking going all crusty. I need me glasses. Alright, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And like if you haven't liked already. Don't thumbs down. Don't fucking thumbs down. I know there's this one troll. There's this one fucking troll that keeps on fucking go and I know who it is. It's not someone I personally know, but I know how to fucking look it up and I know who it is and it's not very nice, buddy. Come on, man. Well, I haven't done anything to you. You're not even watching me. This person has no view time on my videos and he's just being, every time I upload one, he fucking does a thumbs down. I don't know who you are, I don't know why. I've seen your channel on there, I don't know why you would do, are you jealous or something? Is someone a little jelly? Is someone a little jelly? But if you watch the content and you don't like it and you thumbs down it, that's no problem. But when you see on the uh, page that uh, you haven't even watched and you've just clicked on and clicked off and you've clicked the thumbs down, that's sad man, that's sad. Fucking, you're a little fucking keyboard warrior or something, grow up man. But if you watch the content and you don't like it, give it a thumbs down, that's fine. Give it a thumbs up if you like it, share, subscribe, do all that fucking other jazz, do what the fuck you like, do what the fuck you like, do what the fuck, I don't care. I just, I just like looking that up because I know how to do it and it makes me laugh. 
Pathetic people make me laugh. All right. Oof. Got that out of my system. I got the itch to list. I got the itch to list. I'm gonna go list. I'm gonna go watch some Doctor Who while I list. And then uh, next video I will show you everything I got in show and tell. Apart from that, thanks for watching, subscribe, all that jazz that I've already said. Thank you very much and I will see you next time and see you. Come ride with me, let's thrift, let's thrift all day. When you go...